Then I thought I hope you're having a good start to the day so far. I uh, just wanted to elaborate on one of the posts I shared earlier in the week. Um, like if you look at your circle of friends and you don't get inspired, you don't have a circle, you have a cage. And just expanding on that for Karo is when you look at that circle, do you support each other? Do you encourage each other? Do you celebrate with each other when one of you wins? Um, but also, probably as important, or if not more important, do you check each other and call each other out when you're not performing, when you're slacking off, and when you're not living into your potential? Um, I'm so, so lucky to have some awesome people in my life who can do both. They will support me, they encourage me, and they, I'm pretty sure they don't really care what I do, or they don't mind, as long as I'm, you know, growing and challenging myself to be better, as long as I'm a good person and not putting myself or others in harm's way. You know, and that's, that's what I want from my friends too. And, but there are often times where they'll be like, hey, Hannah, like, why did you do that? Or, you know, what were you thinking when this, 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 this? And I love it because, you know, I trust them enough for their judgment about, you know, what I'm doing and what I'm up to. And I know or I trust that they're not doing it to be malicious or they're not trying to attack me. They just want to make sure that I'm considering the bigger picture or um, they're just giving an alternative perspective. And I need that because I'm so self-assured in what I do that oftentimes I can miss, you know, like minor details, which end up being major details. <laughs> so I'm yeah, really lucky to have a group of friends around me who um, not only support me and encourage me to do all the things that I want to do, but can also be like, Hannah, yeah, don't do that. <laughs> or maybe like, show me your pres PowerPoint presentation on why, and then we'll think about it. Um, but... <clears throat> Uh, one story is one of my best mates, once upon a time, um, hadn't heard from them in ages and then finally sent them a message and as we were talking about halfway through the conversation, I go like, hey, how come I don't hear from you anymore? Or like, at all. Like, I always have to initiate kōrero. And they go, oh, I can see you're doing well online. And... <laughs> I think the reaction says it all. My first reaction was like, yeah, and what? You know, there should be a difference between you, my best mate, and all the other thousands of people who can see what I'm up to online, you know? And I, it just didn't sit well, and then the more I thought about it, it's like, oh, so you only check up on me if I'm doing bad or if there's something wrong. I don't, yeah, doesn't sit right with me, and for a few other reasons, believe it or not, um, big surprise, they're not in that circle anymore. <laughs> and moral of the story is, of this whole video, is just like, show up for your mates. You know, call them out when they're not doing what they're supposed to be doing to fulfill their purpose here in this lifetime. You know, support them, encourage them, love them, but know them enough and trust them enough, trust that they trust you enough to let them know if and when they're straying too far from their track. You know, be there for them, let them know. Like sometimes I can't be there physically for my mates, but I try to um, over communicate in every other way that I'm there if they need me. And um, that's all just based on what I value, which are the relationships with the people closest to me in my life. And there aren't many of those people, but they are so quality and I love them heaps. So if you're watching, I love you. Uh, <laughs> but you know, whatever you do with your friends, what, however you guys communicate, like, do that. You know, it might not be a message. But on that note, it only takes, like, 10 seconds to send a message. Be like, hey, um, thinking of you, hope you have a good day. Bye. You know, sometimes my friends just send me emojis that are random as, or they'll tag me and things, like, and I tag them. <laughs> but, you know, like, just, just be there. Be there for each other and um, love each other. I don't even know how to finish this video. <laughs> nah, just be there for your mates. Be a good friend, you know. Develop that high trust and keep reinforcing it um, between each other and you'll be all right. And there's pretty much nothing you can't do if you have a good network of people around you um, who can keep you grounded, keep you centered and aligned to whatever it is you want to do. Just my for cuddle.